Dear Tesla shareholder, I know it hurts. I know it's painful seeing your stock that you believed in so much just dropping and dropping and dropping with no end in sight. Seeing those numbers yesterday, just a painful reminder that you should never buy companies at the top. It hurts. And I understand it, but we here have a solution for you. We have a way to get you your money back and to continue to grow your wealth and grow your funds and continue enjoying your life without having to look at your Tesla stock that will probably keep dropping and dropping and dropping a stock that you've invested so much of your money into. We have a stock for you called SoFi, SoFi right now, dear Tesla shareholders, is currently transforming the financial industry with its innovation and its technology. SoFi currently is at a seven something billion dollar market cap and is the future of the financial sector and will become the behemoth that Tesla was just a few months ago. So if you guys missed the bottom, right? And I'm talking about way, way, way bottom Tesla, five years ago, eight years ago, 10 years ago, you have a chance now to invest your money into SoFi, which in my opinion, is the bottom of the bottom for this stock that it's well on its way to a hundred to two hundred dollars within the next year or two. So imagine that the losses that you took on Tesla, you get all of that back, and it keeps going and going and going. At SoFi, we have earnings coming up on the 29th, which is looking to be our first gap profitable quarter ever. SoFi has been beat, triple beating, triple beats all across the board, across all platforms. SoFi stock right now, in my opinion, is the be beginning of a behemoth that it's going to become just as Tesla did. And you guys have a chance to invest at under an $8 billion market cap. Yesterday, you got it here first. We announced a partnership with Chipotle. Yesterday, we let you guys know that they're buying loans left and right from First Republic. From here, from there. They just announced last week their new small business loan aspect of the company they have every sector of the financial industry covered from their student loans to their mortgages to their personal loans to now small businesses and everything else that they do forbes just covered them yesterday said sofi is the new and the future way of the banking industry. And that all these young folks out there are piling into this company because they understand what it is. They understand where this company is going and everything they need as far as their financial needs is right there for them. Don't be stuck, Tesla shareholders, just watching that price go down and down and down for the next however long. When you could take your losses, right? And this is not financial advice. Don't just listen to me. Don't listen to anybody out there. Do your own research. The numbers are there for you. Instead of watching your money continue to deteriorate, take your losses and look into SoFi. Look into what you're there doing and um, just understand that this company right now has the ability 
to become one of the biggest companies in the world. A few years from now, with what they continuously have been proving to everybody, they got through the worst economic time in recent history, beating on every quarter across the board. They got through the last couple years, which was one of the worst times in history for the economy with triple beats all across the board. Can you imagine how this company is going to perform when they start lowering rates? When we get back to normal and get Joey up out of here, when institutions start flooding into this company, once we do show those profitable numbers, when we beat on EPS, when we beat on revenue, when we beat on EBITDA, can you imagine how fast this company can take off? Or you could just be stuck at Tesla. Or you could be stuck at Tesla. Watching red day after red day after red day. Because that's what's coming. After beating all 1% on their car sold or whatever they had yesterday. That's embarrassing. Elon's too busy with Twitter, with this, with that, whatever he's doing. Right? It's quiet for you guys for a little bit. Look in the SoFi. See what they're doing. Take your loss. Take your lesson. And let's get this money. Come over to SoFi. Monday. The reporting. Before the bell. Look what Palantir did. Right after they became gap profitable. Their numbers ain't nowhere near what SoFi's numbers are and what their valuation is now. You, They can't even compete. You understand what I'm telling you? Palantir ran from $6 to what, 20 something? Pay attention to what's going on. It's written for you. It's all in front of your eyes. Don't get tricked out. Don't get tricked out by these clowns that... Their whole purpose in life is try to scare you out, bully you out to getting your money. Don't let them bully you out. You have a chance to grab a behemoth at the bottom. That's in my opinion. And I got my money where my mouth is. So do your research. And let's get this money. SoFi stock earnings coming up on the 29th of this month. Let's get it, man. I'm out of here.